Okay, girl, I am here to hook you up with this realistic kinky curly lace front wig from the Eunice Hair. If you want to see how I achieved this flawless look, please keep on watching. What's up, what's good, what's popping my Alandaza? Thank you for stopping by today for another hair tutorial. Today's hair video is a sponsored by Uni's Hair. Let's get in this unboxing. So we are unboxing our little Christmas box courtesy of the Uni's Hair. This is the unit that we'll be working with. But of course, you know, I have to show you all the goodies that comes inside of our package. I got a wig cap as well as a edge scarf. And guys, I am super excited about this robe. <laughs> Trust me, I'm, I'm very, very excited. I was very impressed to see that a robe came in my package. And you know, our girl is going to be so extra. So I'm going to show you what that looks like in a few. So I also got an additional edge band as well as some lashes of course you know it's the christmas i don't want to look all bougie cute and whatever and i got two more pairs of wig caps in my package i also got this retractable brush that is like the cutest thing ever i love the fact that it can be tucked away so it's easy to take around with you Today's unit is the realistic kinky curly lace front wig from the Uni's hair and this is a hundred percent human hair and uh, yeah it has that realistic hairline. I love a curly wig. You give me a curly wig and I can wear it Sunday to Sunday so I was not mad at this unit at all. Let's get into the specs of this unit though. So this is a 13 by 4 lace front wig and it has that pre-plucked um, baby hair with of course that natural color. I absolutely am loving the weft inside of it. It feels breathable. It is that realistic hairline and I just am loving every bit of it. So inside of our cap it comes with three combs on the inside as well as two adjustable straps on both sides. Um, yeah and it has that elastic net um, on the inside as well. Well, and as I said guys this is a hundred percent breathable and comfortable and I love the fact that the lace is actually a Swiss lace so it's easy it's easy to melt it's per perfectly easy to work with you don't need any bleaching any thing you know all the extra is that you know you don't need all of that so the hair is super soft this is a hundred and fifty percent density and all the information if you need further information will be of course linked down in my description box and and i think they do currently have a sale still going on so please feel free to click the link in my description box to take advantage of whatever promotion they currently have going super love it i can't wait to try this week guys let's get into it today's video so this is uh, the wig cap that we'll be working with today as you can see this one is a uh, super sheer which i absolutely love so it should make the melting process uh, so seamless um yeah and i do go for that so for my bonding i'll be using of course my got to be spray and for this i'll be using like about three yeah three layers back and forth of course using my blow dryer on the cool or cold setting and ensure that it is dried up the way properly and as i said i'll be applying this about three times and ensuring that this dries all the way completely so it's not you're not gonna wait for it to be tacky or not dried properly it's, you have to get it dried all the way through Next, I'm gonna go in with um, some of my powder. I because the the the, the wig cap is actually so sheer, I did not uh, see the need to use foundation. My powder adhered to this uh, so well, so I'm just using my brush that I got in my package because you know a girl is extra. And as you can see, I have on my beautiful pink robe. Um, yeah, I'm so excited about this, and I'm just gonna go ahead now and remove the excess of my wig cap by just using my little. Um, this scissors is pretty much like a brow scissors 
yeah i think it's really easy to use this as opposed to like our bigger scissors but if you can you can use a bigger scissors it's totally up to you i just prefer to use this um to remove my excess cap next i'm gonna go in now to melt my lace and i'll be using the got to be glue and i'm just taking like bits and pieces of it and i'm just gonna go ahead and line my wig cap all the way across and then i'm gonna go ahead now and use the tail of my rat tail comb to pretty much blend that in and when you do that eventually it pretty much starts to melt the cap because we want like a seamless look we want to look you want to give it sis it's growing from our scalp but sis this here is all ours <laughs> so i'm gonna go in now with my blow dryer and just basically um make that tacky so i'm not drying that all the way through next i'm gonna go ahead now and add reattach my adjustable band ensuring that feels comfortable toward the back of my head before pulling that over it's pretty much self-explanatory in, in terms of putting on my wig pulling that back and i can tell you the hair it feels snug the sun was ensuring that you know it's right and tight and not too tight by the way we're not giving ourselves headache over here so i'm just going to go ahead now and adjust that and there are some adjustable combs inside where from the ear to ear i'm just going to go ahead and pretty much adjust those in thank you so much for clicking on my video today guys you're seeing my face here in my voice for the very first time my name is jody and on this channel you get all things of fashion beauty and lifestyle related so please feel free to consider subscribing if you're new you get videos like this each and every week please guys like the video it helps a girl out and definitely thumbs up this video For a seamless melt, I'm going in with my adjustable um, band to pretty much pre um, lay my edges down before removing my lace, of course, because I want that to be super flat. I want that to be super melted and, of course, super secured. Next, I'm going to go in now with some water. I am just pretty much re-moisturizing the hair, rejuvenating my curls because I know we want to have, a, even though I want to have that kinky kind of vibe, we still want to have it looking all uh, nice we want to look have it looking uh, shiny cute or whatever so i'm going in now with a little bit of my hair mousse to pretty much redefine my curls because i can tell you the curls are so defined and they are so super soft so i'm going to go ahead and work that towards the middle down to the end of my hair because i'll be doing a part and in a few you'll be seeing why i did not want to apply too much moisture towards the top section of my hair so i'm just getting that out the way then i am moving back now to my lace and we will go ahead and remove that in short order because the hair came pre-bleached i did not have to put any of my powder or foundation in it so what i'm doing now is just to put a little bit of my powder around the lining of my hair and then i'm going to go in now with my wax as well as my hot comb to pretty much lay or to help yeah pretty much lay my lace all the way down i want that to be like super duper flat before of course removing my lace and i'm going to go ahead now and just snip two to each side of my ear and just slightly remove those without going too much into my hairline and as you can see guys the lace is like what lace like i can't i mean i'm i sound i probably sound like i'm exaggerating but i promise you i'm not i was like what lace so I'm before removing my where i have the baby here of course that you know i'm gonna secure those because we don't want to snip those off because we're gonna go ahead of course and lay those down and i'm pretty much doing the same thing trying to go in a zigzag method to remove them next i'm gonna go and toe and angle just slightly get down a little bit of the baby hair i am not really a big fan of too much baby hair so it is totally up to you you can add more you can add less exists just rock it how you like it so i'm going to go ahead now and sleek down my edges and then removing whatever excess glue i have on my forehead so i'm just trying to show you as best as i possibly can to show you how easy this unit is um, done 
and you can opt to wear the unit just like this it ha actually has a free part so it's totally up to you you can wear it without a part you can actually put it in a little bun you can do a high bun a half up a half down but today for the purpose of this video i am going to do a center part i absolutely love curly hair with a center part in it i don't know it's just something about it that i absolutely love and once more i'm going in now with my hair wax as well as my hot comb to pretty much define my part and which i'm going to go in now with a little bit of my concealer to pretty much define my part and guys there you have it just like that a girl is now a whole bombshell absolutely love this unit guys remember all the details will be listed down in my description block in the description box so please take advantage and purchase this beautiful unit i 100 recommend it the quality is on point i will be rocking this all christmas long so sis be prepared to be sick of me thanks so much unis here for sending me this beautiful unit absolutely love it guys remember to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already my name is jody and i aspire to inspire until next time guys what good